and welcome back guys so I'm going to be showing you guys how I fixed the issue of my videos being blurry and how to get around the YouTube filter for small channels so as we can see this is the video that I made regarding Cyberpunk 2077 and it's the stage music so we go over here we right click on the video and it's going to come up with AV C1, which is a filter. This is for small channels. This is how YouTube keeps, you know, the file size down and it saves space on their servers. So when you get this filter, yeah, it sucks because it's going to be all pixelated, like, like this pixelated mess we have right here. That's not very enjoyable to watch. So how do we get around this? Well, we want the filter right here that's VP09. This is the filter you want on your channel so it doesn't look like a pixelated mess. So I'm gonna run the video over here and show, look at this pixelated hell. All right, we don't want that. We want this, where it looks nice and clean and you know, you can actually enjoy watching it. So how do we do this? Well, we need to come over here and this is the same video up on the channel. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to custom and we're going to change the resolution here to 2500. We're going to go over here and change this to 1440. And then we're going to go over to restriction KPS and you can set this to 60,000. I was just starting out as 30,000. If it's still pixelated, go up to 40,000. If it's still pixelated, jump up to 60,000. And if it's still pixelated, go up to 80,000. And then you just add it to render queue, render it. It may take the file size will be bigger, but if your file size is bigger, you will have that special filter that you need in order to have a nice looking video like this. So you want VPO9. You do not want the filter VC, V or AVC. You do not want this filter. They will make your videos look like crap. So hopefully this was helpful. Make sure it's like button. Make sure to subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next videos.